We successfully created the filter that seems to be working fine. But let's understand how to handle the multiple filter scenario in a Spring Boot application. So now we already have what you know one filter in our application. So what I'm going to do, I'm, I'm going to copy this. I'm going to paste this filter, right? So before that, I'm going to rename the filter as what? My filter underscore two. Let me create one more filter. I'm going to rename it as what you know my filter underscore three so if you look at it we have two filters so my filter one so that says what you know filter one is called my filter two that says what you know filter one is called let me change it as what you know filter two is called likewise filter three is called right so now if you look at it we have what you know three filters available in our application but the thing is how exactly the three filter will be called right so let's quickly let's quickly what you know rerun this application we'll see how this filter is actually what you know behind right so we have filter one filter two filter three now let's see what is the exact sequence the time of execution right let me clear this console let me go to what you know the postman let me quickly hit this one now go back here now you can see what you know the filter one is called two is called and three is called okay now we have a requirement that i want for example consider we want a three to be called first one to be called second and this to be called what you know last so i have to do that right you know in order to do that so let's go back to what in the filter i'm going to add one more annotation called order annotation inside the order annotation i'm going to say what you know my filter should be called what you know second the sequence of this filter actually what you know two order annotation the sequence of this filter actually what three and then sequence of this filter actually what you know one now you can see that you know this is going to be the one this is going to be the two and then this is going to be what you know three so the what is the expected output so three one and two right so let's see whether that is happening or not let me read in the application so now our application is started let me clear this console let me go back to what you know the postman i'm trying to getting this api let's see here we go we got what you know three one two 